friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach. I'm back from plastic surgery and I'm here with a grocery haul. As soon as I got home, I immediately placed a grocery order and Troy picked it up and I have lots to share with you. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I typically upload five videos every single week. Check out the description box down below where you will find nutrition coaching links and discounts to my favorite things, and my Facebook group, we would love to have you. So let's head on into the kitchen for this week's grocery haul. So here is my grocery haul for the week after returning from my plastic surgery. We did a pickup at Sprouts and a pickup at Walmart. What you don't see is a case of Diet Coke for Troy. He's putting that away in the garage as I speak. So let me show you what I picked up. So starting with Walmart, another big box of his favorite cereal. This is the Kashi Toasted Berry Crisp. This cereal is actually really good, especially on yogurt. It's a nice crunch and it has a little sweetness and some berries in it. I actually really like it as well. It's his all time favorite. And then I did pick up a couple of packs of instant mashed potatoes. That way we can make kind of KFC bowls. I plan on doing that. It's a simple dinner. I'm actually not allowed to cook for two weeks or be in the heat. I can't remember what the reasoning was, so I thought that Troy could easily put this together. And I also bought some instant mashed potatoes from Sprouts as well. We needed some more sliced cheese for sandwiches. Troy asked for ravioli, so I just got a four pack. That way he'd have that that he could warm up and have as a lunch or dinner. We also needed, of course, some more milk for his cereal. He asked for soup, so I did a can of Progresso tomato and then some classic chicken noodle. And then for those bowls, I needed gravy. So I got the turkey gravy. I've tried the chicken, the beef, the turkey. The turkey's actually my favorite for those kind of mock KFC bowls. I also picked up some more lavash bread. I love this bread. It has protein in it, omega-3s, fiber. I like to have this. I have half of one usually and make a wrap out of it and grill it up, kind of like a grilled cheese or grilled ham and cheese. I really love the lavash bread, so I picked up another pack. Also gauze, because you know, I need that post-surgery, so I grabbed two boxes. And then some of my favorite toothpaste I love from this brand, Hello, the anti-plaque and whitening. It's a good pepper mint toothpaste and I was about out so I picked up a refill. Part two of the Walmart grocery haul. I forgot to order everything to do meal prep. So I placed another order and Troy went and picked it up. So let me show you what's in part two. So first I ordered a whole bunch of candles. I actually went on the Bath and Body Works website to order some candles there and they're not having a sale right now and I'm not spending $27 per candle. So I decided to try out the Walmart brand. I thought it doesn't hurt and these ranged anywhere from about $4 to $7, so a much better deal. So I got some fun summer scents, Frosty Sorbet Pop, Sweet Sugared Lemon, Plumeria Palm, Juicy Watermelon, Strawberry Dandelion, Peach Mango, Iced Caramel Macchiato, Hazelnut Cream, and then Coastal Coconut. So these, we'll test them out. We'll see if they have as good of a scent throw as Bath & Body Works. And then I also ordered a whole bunch of wax melts because the place I normally get wax melts from almost doubled their price. So I thought, again, we'll test these out. They were a dollar to $2 a piece. So I have two of the Hawaiian Coconut Driftwood Waves. Strawberry Crunch, Caribbean Orange, Frosted Berry Cupcake, Aloha Pineapple, Plumeria Palm, Juicy Watermelon, Frosty Sorbet Pop, Strawberry Waffle Cone, and Blueberry Sorbet. So again, some really fresh, fruity summer scents. I needed some non-fat instant dry milk for my meal prep. We were all out of saltines and I'm making a soup as part of my meal prep, so I needed some more crackers. I decided to grab some white uh, macadamia nut cookies so that we would have those on hand. A pound of 99% ground turkey. This is actually for my lunch meal prep. I needed some honey for a dessert recipe. I forgot to pick it up when I went to Sam's Club last time, which is a much better deal, but I did decide to get this local honey, this US raw pure honey. A can of light coconut milk. I have a really fun recipe that I wanna share with you with a brand new product from Clean Simple Eats in next Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. 
a couple of cans of black beans for my lunch meal prep as well as a can of diced tomatoes with green chilies. And then I actually ordered two big cans of green chilies and they didn't have any. So I got four tiny cans as a substitution. And that is also for my lunch meal prep. I was completely out of rolled oats, so I got the Bob's Red Mill Organic Rolled Oats. I need these for my breakfast meal prep. And then something I never buy but was part of my dessert prep is meringue powder. And I know that you can make meringues and divinity and some fun stuff during the holidays with this. So I know that I'll use this up, so I ordered that. Why are you guys always right here during the groceries? All right, here. Tell your friends that you need groceries too. Yeah, you need groceries too. I got a whole bunch of limes. I'm going to do lime and mint water in my little glass pitcher off of Amazon, a yellow onion for my lunch meal prep, and then four pears for my breakfast meal prep. So that is Walmart haul part two. And then moving into sprouts, two things of cottage cheese because I've been missing my cottage cheese with fruit on it. I'm actually going to have that after I film this video. So I picked up two containers. I also lacked, I feel like a little bit on my protein while I was gone just because I didn't have control over the food that I was eating, nor was I very hungry. So I really wanna pick back up and get all of my protein in. And then I got some ginger out of the bulk section because I like to have this after my meals for digestion. I like the one from Trader Joe's better, but I also can't drive for a couple weeks. So I decided to grab some out of the bulk bin at Sprouts. And then I actually ordered the cinnamon almonds and they gave me just plain almonds. I was going to make my little trail mix with pumpkin seeds and fruit and almonds, but I wanted the cinnamon ones and got the raw. So I may have to reach out to them about that. Two bags of Troy's favorite popcorn, the Himalayan gold lesser evil. That's his very, very favorite. And he said he ate up most of the popcorn while I was gone. So I picked him up two bags and then three packs of their pre-cooked shredded chicken. Lola does not eat after chemo. And like I mentioned in the last chemo session, she was actually pretty sick for quite a few days. And the only thing she will eat is this chicken. So we wanted to make sure that we had plenty on hand for our KFC bowls and also for Lola post her chemo. I got some snickerdoodle cookies just for fun. Troy likes having a cookie on hand. And then these are the pre-made mashed potatoes from Sprouts. I got these and the instant. That way if Troy can't cook and I wanna make a bowl, I have ones ready to go. And then I also grabbed him this chicken alfredo meal pre-made meal i thought this would be helpful for him again an easy quick dinner or lunch that way we're not eating out and we're just eating a little bit healthier even though i can't actually cook and then of course all my fruits and veggies so i got some mini cucumbers lots of fruit i also missed my fruit so two big packs of strawberries two packs of blueberries, two packs of blackberries, and then some pre-cut up pineapple. This is my all-time favorite thing to put on the cottage cheese. And then I grabbed a couple of avocados too, just to really start pumping up that healthy fat as well. So that is everything that I picked up for the week from Sprouts as well as Walmart. I don't have a dinner plan for you. I don't have a meal prep plan for you yet, but there will be a meal prep on Monday. I'm just not sure exactly what that looks like yet. So that is this week's grocery haul. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. It feels good to be back to filming. It's exhausting, everything's exhausting, but it feels good to be back to filming and having healthy food in my house again. I'm really excited to meal prep and kind of get back to normal. So if you enjoyed the grocery haul, give it a big, huge thumbs up. Again, subscribe if you're not. I would love to have you here and check out that description box for nutrition coaching links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group, another community that's supportive and loving and would love to have you be part of it. Thank you for watching, friends. Happy Saturday, and I'll see you tomorrow in my plastic surgery vlog. Bye.